Chimendan Jha is one of the three divination arts called the Sanshi. They are the Taiyi Shanshu, Chimendan Jha, and Daliran. Chinese metaphysics is based on the cosmology of the Trinity, Sun Tsai, Heaven, Earth, and Man. Chimendan Jha is the Earth level. It is well suited for military affairs such as uh, how to meet the enemy, which direction, what time, in what formation, attack or retreat, set ambush or meet the enemy head on. The chart can also tell what is the enemy's plan and reaction. It can also give indication about the weather in the coming days. Sanqi were considered the imperial arts in China's history, there had been many stories of great master of the Sanxi who helped the emperor or helped someone to become the emperor using their knowledge. Because of the power of this system, their secrets were highly guarded by those in power, namely the emperors. In the beginning, Chimendan Jha was used in military and they wars. In modern time, Chimendan Jha can be used in many aspects of life. Today, in a broad sense, we say that life is like being in a battle. Common application of Chimendan Jha are love and marriage, health and sickness, career, business, making money, finding lost property or missing people, solving crimes, stock trading, weather prediction, life reading, litigation, and feng shui. Qi Men Den Jia consists of four words. Qi means strange, mystic, wonder, man, means door, dun means hidden, evade, ja is the first of the ten stems. Ja is the leader of the ten stems. It is the most dignified and important. In a warfare it is the field marshal and is hidden, so that the enemy do not know where to attack. Three wonders, Yi Bing Ding, are the ones who assist and defend the Jia, while the six emblems represent six different legions, and they take turn to hide the Jia. A complete Chimendu Jia chart consists of four dimensions earth, man, heaven, and spirits. These are the most important ingredients of the charts. They are used to analyze the Qi interaction in the nine palaces of the Luoshu. The four dimensions are Dipan, composed of nine stem and nine palaces, Tianpan, composed of the nine stars and nine stems, Renpan, consisting of the eight doors and Shen Pan consisting of the eight spirits. This is an example of a Chimendu Jia chart. But let's take a closer look at each level. The Dipan contains nine palaces and nine stems. Dipan represent location and directions on earth. The Tianpan contains nine stems and nine stars. The nine stars exert to have an influence on human affairs. Their influence is action oriented. The Renpan contains eight doors. The eight doors are indication of locations and directions for various human affairs. The Shenpan contains 
eight spirits. The eight spirits are the heavily influence on human affairs. Their influence is fundamental. Here we see another example of a complete Chimendanja chart. Chimendanja is not another kind of divination like Yi Jing or Plum Blossom. It is the actual study of Qi and the Qi interaction between the four dimensions of heaven, earth, man and spirit at any given moment. The Chimendanja chart captures information about the Qi at that moment and indicates the current situation regarding the Yongshan or spirit of focus. Here is a real life example on how Jimendunja is applied. On March 5, 2013, 1.26 pm, a client called. He was anxious to sell one of his houses to raise some cash. We looked at the Chimendan chart of that moment. By analyzing the chart, we told the client that he would be able to sell the house quite quickly with a profit. However, we could tell that he would not receive his money until May. Here in the chart, the house is represented by the birth door, while the person is represented by his birth year stem E. We see that the birth door is in Gun Palace, while the client is in Kan Palace. The money is represented by Wu in Qian Palace. The interaction between these three palaces indicates that the house would sell quickly and that there would be a profit. However, the buyer could not come up with the money right away because the Qian Palace is void. The void would be filled in May and that is when the client would receive the money for the sale. As it turned out, just as Qimen Dunjia predicted, within one week of putting the house on the market, it was sold. However, the buyer had to wait for the bank to issue the loan before making the payment. The loan finally came through at the beginning of May and the client received his money. Here is another example of using Chimentan Jia to help with investing money. On October 15, 2012, at 1.59 p.m., a client called to ask for help to make a decision on investing. She said that all her friends and investors' advisors were telling her that it was a good time to buy gold and silver. She was considering to invest a large sum of her money and hold for a long term. Was this a good idea? We looked at the Chimendunja chart. Here, the client is represented by her birth year stem Qi in Khan, while Xin in the Kung Palace represents silver. Wu in Zhen Palace represents capital. This chart told us that it's not good for her to buy silver right now. Next, we also look at the gold, which is represented by open door in Gan. Again, the chart indicated that she should not buy gold this time. She decided to follow our advice and not to buy gold and silver like all her friends did. Just as Qimen Dunjia predicted, the price of gold and silver soon started to decline, and today she is very grateful that she did not buy gold and silver at that time. Want to learn more? If you want to watch 
a video preview of Master Edu Hess teaching Chi Mun Jia in class. You can get in through our secret door. What you need to do is click the link below the video. You can also see it here, bit.ly, B-I-T dot L-Y forward slash Chi Mun, Q-I-M-E-N. I look forward to welcoming you on the other side.